the mountain. Welcome back to King of the Mountain Tournament 2, qualifying race number 4. Up first we have M-Power, driven by Allison Chains. The M-Powered is a Hot Wheels BMW M1. It features ultra hot wheels and weighs in at 72.2 grams. Up next we have AMG, driven by Ash. The AMG is a white 2019 Mercedes-Benz A-Class made by Hot Wheels. It weighs in at 73.6 grams. Then we have the Audi House driven by Timmy Vincent for Fat End Racing. The Audi House is a blue 2017 Audi RS6 Avant made by Hot Wheels. This car weighs in at 82.4 grams. And last up, we have the Orange Psychic, driven by the Gummy Bear. That's what they wrote down. The Gummy Bear is representing for 2505 Racing. The Orange Psychic is a Jaguar XE SV Project 8 made by Hot Wheels, and it weighs in at 100 grams. The drivers will face off in four races. Whoever has the most points in the end will advance on to the second King of the Mountain Tournament. Here we go, the Battle of the Luxury Brand Cars. The drivers are at the start. Here. We. Go. go! Allison Chains is off to an early lead in the BMW. She's followed by Timmy Vincent in the Audi. Ash and Gummy Bear lagging behind. This might be another two-car race. Everyone's still on the track so far. No one's wrecked. Allison in the lead around that final corner. Timmy Vincent looking for the pass! Wow, that was a close finish. Allison Chains just barely holding on to it to take the first win of the night. You know, it's really nice to see all the cars making it down to the finish line. Yeah, no wreck so far, but this is just the first race of the night. Let's take another look at that battle between Allison Chains and Timmy Vincent. Watch Timmy Vincent in the blue Audi picking up speed coming out of that final corner. You can see right here he nudges the back end of that BMW. That sends Allison Chains into the side wall. Very close finish right there. Here we go with race two. We've got Ash in the front right and Gummy Bear on the front left. Gummy Bear has the heaviest car in this race, weighing in at 100 grams. The next heaviest car is the Audi at 82.4 grams. That's a 17.6 gram difference. But as we know from this channel, the heaviest car does not always win. Look at this right here. Whoa. Timmy Vincent makes a pass down the straightaway. Oh yeah. And just like that, Timmy Vincent takes the lead in this race driving in the Audi house. Once again, another clean run from all the drivers, everyone making it to the finish line. No DNFs yet. Yes, I think this is some of the cleanest racing we've seen so far for the second tournament of King of the Mountain. Here's another look at that amazing pass right there. Look at Timmy Vincent go. Look at how he passes, but then also goes up high on the curve to block. Not that he really needed to do that, but that is a skilled driver right there. Hey, Timmy Vincent's got the moves. Here we go with race three of four. We have Gummy Bear on the front right and Timmy Vincent on the front left. You know, I don't really know about having Gummy Bear as a driver name. It's kind of cute. I think it's a little soft. This is King of the Mountain Street Racing. Hey, everyone gets to pick their own driver. Maybe this person really like Gummy Bears. Well, they need to stop snacking and start driving because they're falling way behind in this race. Timmy Vincent with a big lead right here as he goes around the final corner. It's Timmy Vincent followed by Allison Chains in the BMW. And Timmy Vincent will pick up his second win of the night. That's going to bring his points up to 13. Allison Chains in second place with nine points. Gummy Bear with six. And Ash at the very bottom with five points. Poor Ash. That's going to be a real mark of shame if he finishes behind Gummy Bear. The way Timmy Vincent handles those corners is very impressive. Look at how smooth he came out of turn two. This is it, the final race. It looks like Timmy Vincent has it in the bag unless something really crazy happens on this one. Timmy Vincent with a four point lead over Allison Chains. Both drivers are in the front row. Allison Chains is gonna need to win this race. And also, you know what, look at this, Never mind. That's not gonna happen. Timmy Vincent way ahead of the rest of the cars as he goes into turn two. That Audi is flying. He's having some problems right there. Here comes Allison Chains. Allison banks into the back end of the Audi. Timmy Vincent still got it. And Timmy Vincent will take the win and advance on to the second tournament of King of the Mountain. Wow, did you see that second place finish? That was a photo finish right there. We're gonna have to go to the replay. I didn't even see, I was distracted by Timmy Vincent. Here they come, right there. Wow, that was close. We're gonna have to see that from another angle. Let's see if we can tell right here. 
Ooh, wow. that was really close. That might be a tie. Let's see if we can settle it from the sky cam. One last time. The Beamers got it. Allison Chains will take second place. 12 points, not a bad finish. But once again, in King of the Mountain qualifying, if you ain't first, you're, you're last. last. Timmy Vincent in the Audi house advances on to the second King of the Mountain tournament and is currently in first place on the qualifier list. You've been watching the King of the Mountain here on the 3D Bot Maker Diecast Racing League. A big shout out to all of our channel members who helped make this possible. We know who you are. We see those badges. Represent. Mm -hmm.